Do you really think twice before setting a password for your online accounts? I'm talking about the strength of the passwords you select. For example, 123409B, Hello89, these passwords are so common and simple. Everyone should avoid to keep passwords like these. So, what should you do? Simply, choose a strong password. But how can you find your chosen password is truly strong or not? Don't worry. I came up here with the solution of it. A strong password is a very crucial part to prevent any online or offline account from being exploited or hacked easily. There are many more steps you should keep in mind to keep your account safe. A strong password must be complex and long. The reason behind keeping a complex password is because it takes more time and effort to guess that password by hackers. In this video, I'll show you how a Python program can check the strength of any passwords and tell you the status. The logic of this program has been built using Python regular expressions. Let's get into the main topic. First, I'm gonna try with a simple password, containing only small letters and the length is less than 10. Let's see what happens. It's a weak password. Let's try with another one. This time our password will contain small letters, numbers, and the length would be greater than 10. I hope this time our program will return a positive value. Oh no. Still the same message we're getting. Okay enough, now we will give a password containing small letters, numbers, at least one special characters, and the length would be greater than 10. Oh my god. It's also a weak password. What should we do right now? Okay, let's try with the last one. This time we will put upper and lower case both letters, numbers, special characters, and the length would be greater than 10. Let's see what happens. It was truly a strong password. I hope now you have understood what a strong password looks like. Know more in details about this topic also with the source code from my website. The link is in the description box. That's all for today, see you in the next video. Happy coding!